Hey yo, what's going on guys, and we are back with more Let's Play Pokemon Heart Gold. I'm Sovelagery, and today guys, we're going to be catching a new team member. So guys, into the grass, here we go, let's go ahead and look for the new Pokemon that we're going to be adding to our team. Hopefully we can catch it here real quick. And it's going to be a Red Attack, guys. That is not the Pokemon that we're going to be adding to our team. I would never add a Red Attack to my team, guys. Would you ever add a Red Attack to your team? I don't think so, guys. Unless you guys really like Red Attack. There's no shame in it, but obviously, Youngster Joey would add it to his team. But there we go, guys. We found the real Pokemon that I'm going to be adding to our team. It is a Mareep. So let's, guys. So, guys, let's go ahead and try to catch right here. Here we go. Water Gun. Hopefully, we don't kill it. Let's see. Come on, don't. Okay, guys. We got to be careful because. I'm not trying to kill Mareep. All right, here we go, guys. Let's go ahead and go for the Pokemon. Hopefully, it'll work out. Hopefully, this Mareep does not give too much trouble. But if we catch it, we got a new team member. So, let's see. Come on, please. Come on, we got this. We got this. Yes, there we go, guys. Oh, that was so easy. Bet. All right, guys. We got a new team member. We got Mareep. All right, that is good, guys. So, now it's time for us to give it a nickname. So, let's see. Mareep, the wolf Pokemon, has been added to the Pokedex. Alright, so let's see. What is the nickname? It is a male Mareep, so let's see. I had a nickname for my original Mareep back in the day. And I'm going to go ahead and choose the same one, guys. So I'm going to choose the same, the same nickname that I had on my original uh, Mareep. So let's see. If I can spell it right, I'm going to go ahead and name it Amphorae right here. Because that's the original nickname I had. And you know, I want to keep the, uh, the, the tradition. So let's see. Alright, so Amphorae. That should be the way to spell it if I'm correct. So Amphorae, the... The Mareep, is that okay? Let me see if that... Okay, yeah, guys, we spelled Amphrey. There we go, guys, we got a new team member, um, Amphrey the Mareep. So, guys, now that we got that out of the way, let's go ahead and go back to Violet City. And let's see, let's go ahead and heal up real quick. And I'm pretty sure if I'm correct, we got to make our way to the Pokemon Tower. Oh, what is that one place called again? It's called something. I don't know what it's called, but it's called the Tower of Something. Uh, is Bell Tower, that's what it's called, right? Yeah, a Bell Sprout Tower, something like that. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and heal up our team. Which is only two Pokemon, but you know, we, we got this, we got this. Alright, let's see. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and go back. Well, yeah guys, and I'm having a pretty good day uh, today. I'm about to go out um, with some friends and family in a bit. So, I'm going to have a pretty good time later today. So, yeah, hopefully, you know, this day is going by pretty good. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just enjoying the day, you know, playing some Pokemon here at my house. And, you know, just it's just fun, guys. So, we are here in Sprout Tower. It's called Sprout Tower, not Bell Tower. My goodness. Alright, let's see. Alright, so I'm trying to walk here. How do I take away the little running shoes? Oh, uh, there we go. Alright, so now we can walk. And does this lady battle us? Hello, miss. A bell sprout over 100 feet tall. People say that it became the middle pillar here. Alright, nice story. So, where do we gotta go? I'm trying to see. I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of monks and people we got about here, right? So, let's go ahead and make our way up the ladder. Here we go. Let's see. Okay, so we got a monk over here. Um, I recently just watched the Karate Kid, the fourth movie, and that's why I call these monks because they were um, bald, you know, um, they were bald people in the exact same robes. Oh, oh gosh, what the? Sage Nico sent out Bellsprout, and I have nothing to counter it, but good thing we do got a high level, uh, Totodile right here, so we should be fine, guys, we should be fine. There we go, let's see, Bellsprout again, sheesh, I don't think I can compete with this, guys. Oh my gosh, we are about to lose. Wait, actually, this is not a Nuzlocke. I can kind of relax for a bit, guys. All right, let's see. Um, no healing up during battle. I don't believe in that stuff, guys. I don't believe in healing up. Like, I don't at all, guys. Let's see. All right, so let's go ahead and go for tackle. Take it down real quick. Here we go. There we go, guys. We defeated him. And now let's go ahead and continue on. So let's see. Let's go ahead and make our way down right here. I'm pretty sure this is where we got to go. And yeah, let's see. We do got a Pokeball. Let's go ahead and grab it. And it is a Paralyzed Heal. And hopefully that can uh, help us out a bit. So let's see. I guess I can heal up while I'm not battling, right? It just makes sense, you know. Well, what's the point of having potions if you're not going to use it? Uh, How do I? Oh, there we go. Let's see. Yeah. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon real quick. And there we go. All right, guys. Let's see. I'm pretty sure this is where Ho-Oh lives, right? At the end of the game, you can catch Ho-Ho here. And that's, you know, that's how you catch legendary Pokemon. And we do got another Muk battle here, guys. Let's go ahead and take them on real quick. And I'll be seeing you guys in just a bit.
All right, guys, there we go. That battle went way more smooth than the other one. But now let's go ahead and go up this ladder right here and try to make our way to the top. Or what are we supposed to do here exactly? Aren't we supposed to, like, um, battle, like, a certain amount of monks and then, you know, eventually get enough EXP to battle the gym leader, right? Is that the way it's supposed to go? But, I mean, if that's the way it's supposed to be, we are getting some pretty good training. And we did find a Pokemon. And screw that. Screw you, right Rattata. I'm not trying to catch you, buddy. All right, let's see. Hmm. All right, I'm trying to see. Where do we got to go next? Oh my gosh, dude, that guy can see far, wow. What? That is actually pretty far, wow. Okay, dude. But yeah, guys, I'll be back in a bit. Alright guys, we defeated that one guy, now let's go ahead and continue on. So, where do we gotta go? I'm pretty sure we gotta go up here, if I'm correct. Oh, we do got a Pokeball though, let's go ahead and grab it real quick. And that's cool guys, you know, I always keep forgetting this, but I keep forgetting our Pokemon is walking with us. And, uh, you know, it's just so fun seeing it walking with us, you know. Because it like this is the only game that, you know, Pokemon can walk with you. Except for the newer ones, of course, like uh, Let's Go and Shield. Oh, no, wait. No, they don't walk with you in Shield. I think they're doing Let's Go and uh, what else? What else? Pokemon Sun and Moon? No, they don't even have that either, huh? I don't think so. But anyways, we do got a Bell Sprite right here. And let's just go ahead and take it down real quick. And I don't think we're doing much damage to it. Nope. Oh, my gosh. Amphrey fainted. That is not good. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's go and go for that scratch. Oh, my gosh. Okay, good thing this is not a Nuzlocke. If not, that would have been a death right there. Um, Like, you know... I guess that's the way you Nuzlocke people like to call it. So yeah, guys, we do got another battle. Alright, let's see if we do got Bell Sprouts. Let's try and take it down real quick. And I'm, I'm just trying to get to the top, guys, low-key. I'm just trying to make it to the top. Alright, let's see. But yeah, guys, I'm getting... Oh, the rival's over there. Yo, I can see our rifle over there, but how do we get to him? Okay, so I'm pretty sure we're not going the right way then. Oh, I'm pretty sure we got to battle him, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we gotta battle him, guys. If not, we're gonna lose against him, and we gotta start all over and do this crap all over again. So, let's see. Uh, scratch attack, there we go. And we did grow up to level 13, and we want to learn Bite. That is a very good move. Forget that for Leer, man. I'm not gonna use Leer whatsoever. So, guys, we learn Bite, and that's all we need. So, oh, there's our rival. Oh, no. I was not trying to... Oops. Uh, sorry, I did not mean to. He showed us what you've got, and indeed, it is good. Take this technical machine. However, you should care more about your Pokemon. The way you treat your Pokemon can be too harsh. Remember, Pokemon are tools of war. Huh. He called himself the Elder, but he was m no match for me. Sure enough, these lecture how should be called nice to Pokemon. They cannot defeat me. All I care about are strong Pokemon that win every time. The rest of them don't mean anything to me. Silver escape using the escape rope. Alright, so. Let's go ahead and get this po- Oh! Fudge. All right, guys, let's go ahead and run away though. Um, how early can we get repels in the game? Because I'm not trying to run into any wild Pokemon anymore, guys. It's low key kind of annoying. If you guys have been playing Pokemon as long as I have, you guys know that finding wild Pokemon that you don't want to find is pretty annoying. So let's see. So good of you to come here. Spout Tower is a place of training people and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I'm the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you, you and your Pokemon. Fudge, I didn't heal up though, old man. Come on, man. You can't be battling us like that. Sheesh. All right. We do got a spell sprout right here. And I refuse to heal up, guys. I refuse to heal up. Like, you guys already know me. I don't like healing up during battle. <laughs> and one of you guys uh, kind of uh, called me out for that in one of the comment sections. And that was pretty funny. I like that. It was a funny joke. But anyways, we did grow up to level 14. And that is all good. Hmm, the way you battle is quite elegant. You should be able to sign up to Faulkner. You should be able to make good use of this. And we did gain Technical Machine Flash, which is pretty good for caves, so yeah. Alright guys, now let's go ahead and do the same trick that our rival did. Let's go ahead and use an Escape Rope to get out of here. We do have one, right? Um, let me try to find it real quick. I don't... Oh, we don't have an Escape Rope. Oh, yeah, we do. Alright, bet. That was pretty cool. Alright. Here we go. Escape Rope. Let's do this. Finally, some daylight. All right, guys, let, let's go ahead and heal up and get ready for that gym badge, guys, because our first gym badge here in Johto is almost coming. It's coming by so fast, you know, I can't believe it. I can't believe, guys, I'm just playing Pokemon Hard Gold again, you know. To me, it just feels amazing. I have not played this game 
like in I don't know how many years, like 10 years, I don't know, but I have not played this game since it last came out, and I think I lost my original save copy, and it kind of sucks because I don't really know, I want to see my original Pokemon, you know, I, I want to see the Pokemon that I originally had, and uh, you know, uh, you know, I, I would really like to see them all over again. But the Pokemon that I know that I did have, I had a Feraligatr, Ampharos, and a couple of other Pokemon too. Which is the reason why I'm choosing this Pokemon to add to the team. I want to keep the tradition. I want to keep my, my Jodo team alive. I want to bring them back. And I want to adventure th uh, with them throughout, you know, all over again. So yeah, let's see. Alright guys, I'm pretty sure we're ready for the gym. If you guys are ready, let's go ahead and go inside and try to see what we got. Yo, the first gym. What's up, man? What's up, Gym Meter, dude? Yo, champ in the making. I'm no trainer, but I can give some advice. Believe me, if you believe, then a championship dream can come true. You believe? Then listen. The grass type is weak against flying type. Keep it. Keep, okay, that that was pretty obvious information. But let's see. Oh gosh, guys, I have not been here in a while. Okay, so let me go ahead and go up here, right here. And that was great. So usually I would not battle the trainers because, as you guys can see, there is an easier way to avoid them. I can just go up here and boom, no trainers for me. But I need the EXP, guys. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take on one or two of them real quick, and we should be good for the gym badge. So let's see. I can't believe how ridiculous high this is. But from up here, you can tell what it is to feel like to be a bird Pokemon. Let me see if you're good enough to face Falker. All right, guys. His name is Faulkner, by the way. I don't know why I said Falker, but let's see. Got a Sparrow right here, and it is level 9. That is pretty bad for us, guys. Okay, we're going to need to do some off-screen training after this episode for sure. Yeah, we need some off-screen training in order to be a Faulkner, the gym leader. But let's go ahead and bite it real quick, and there we go, guys. We defeated it, and yes. But guys, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and end, uh, end off the episode right here because we need some off-screen training, as you guys can see. But yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. So until then, guys, peace out.